Hello and welcome back to Snow Fog Outdoors. This video is an unboxing video of a couple items that I ordered from uh, Mr. Paul Dorr at Paul Dorr Bushcraft. Um, what an awesome guy. I His business is on Etsy. I believe he also has a uh, website that you can view. But I, I, I found them on Etsy and I was looking at different um, bushcraft gear and pouches and bags. And, you know, whenever I think of bushcraft, the first thing that comes into my mind is the UK. Uh, when I first started out a couple years ago, there were so many channels that inspired me and taught me. Uh, Mike from MCQ Bushcraft and the Wilshire Man. Uh, which we know is Sandy from Jack Lore Knives, uh, Fog360, my very good friend, and just a ton, ton of channels that really know bushcraft and do bushcraft well. So, if you get back on track, I ordered a belt pouch and a fire kit. And you're probably saying, well, Diane, you know, you can make your own pouch, you can make your own fire kit. Yes, I can, and yes, I have made them. But... It means something different when you can get it from the birthplace, I guess you can say, of bushcraft. I mean, and I'm sure the UK is not the birthplace, but it's really hard to explain. But I think you understand what I mean. And Paul is such a master craftsman when it comes to leather and, you know, he does knives and just a plethora of, of bushcraft items and yeah I can make my own but you know it's all about supporting others in the community that do this for a living and you know and they're good at it so without further ado let's crack open this box shall we I still want to cut anything so I want to make sure that I don't. I know I'm cutting the wrong way. I know my way around a knife, I think. <laughs> I know how to cut myself with a knife. I'm trying to get into this tape because I really don't want to put too much, too much, uh, knife into this box. Aha. There we go. Let's put this sharp bad boy away here. Ori, what you smelling? Leather? You smelling leather? Uh, one Viking pouch and one full fire kit. Many thanks. And he includes a little page of all his stuff that he makes. Very, very nice stuff. Very easy to, to contact and have conversations with. And just an awesome guy. Even the bubble wrap smells good. So let's set this here. Oh, my. I ordered the medium brown and chestnut brown. Oh my goodness, look at that. Look at that stitching. I wish you could smell this right now. Oh my God. It smells absolutely amazing. I'm going to put a little bit of the fire kit in here. This is quality, folks. Absolute. And you can fit a good amount of stuff in there. You really can. Very nice, Paul. Thank you so much. Wow. Very nice work. Love it, love it, love it. So there's the pouch. This is his Tinder pouch. Mine look nothing like this. Mmm, again, smells awesome. A little antler button. Oh, look at that. 
filled with dry grass. Very cool. You fit a good amount of stuff in there, let me tell you. And I don't even have it all the way open. That's beautiful. Fire steel. Which is going to go in there. And he also included some nice white birch. Oh, the light's glaring off of it. White birch bark. Oh, and some fat wood. Who doesn't like fat wood? Oh my god. Look out, Hank. You're going to knock the tripod over. That's Hank, my cat. Oh, that smells just amazing. Oh, four pieces of fat wood. Kind of got a really sweet smell to it. And this is the flint and steel kit. Very nice striker. Let me set this down. Very, very nice striker. Oh, very comfortable striker. Some char cloth. Ooh, two nice pieces of flint. Two good sizes. Look at the size of that flint. Awesome. I was needing more flint. Hank, this looks like it's a flash tinder of some sort. Oh my God, it's actual cotton. Yep, that's real cotton. Not cotton balls, but actually cotton from the cotton plant. This light in here is terrible. Someday I'll get that right. That's beautiful. That is really soft. Hank, you gonna learn how to hit a fire steel? Yeah? And a business card. Very cool. Wow, that glare is bad. Very bad. What a beautiful flint and steel kit. Very nice tin. Really good size. I mean, there's the palm of my hand. It's bigger, bigger than an Altoids tin. Yeah, Hank's going to lay right there and get in on everything. Earlier it was Pittance hamming up, and now it's Hank. Very, very nice. Very impressed. Very nice kit. Well, there you have it. My fire kit. Traditional fire kit from Paul Dar Bushcraft. And a beautiful leather pouch. And the leather Viking pouch. Belt pouch. Alright guys, that'll do it for this video. Hank, you gonna say night night? Say bye, Hank. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one.